Hey, Amanda here, bringing you into our life at Hotel Moro. Today, I wanna to take you inside one of the first big projects that we finished here when we first bought the building. Don't forget to subscribe. It's totally free to do so, and you can change your mind at any time. Also, hit the notification bell if you wanna be notified every time our videos are posted, which should be every Tuesday. When we bought this building, this space was in the process of becoming a two bedroom apartment. It was a little bit too tight for us to feel good about continuing that project. So we ended up pulling out the walls and kind of starting over from scratch and turning it back into a studio apartment. One fun feature in this space is that it used to have a vault, which is now what we are turning into like a pantry closet space. So the walls are like super thick cement and you can tell that it would have originally had like a vault door on it. So it's kind of, kind of a neat feature in this, uh, this little studio. So to get started, we cleared all the stuff out and uh, took a look at what we were working with. From the way that the walls were built, you can tell that at one point it did have a drop ceiling when this whole project was started. Um, so it uh, definitely needed to have something done with it, but we just removed those walls to kind of take care of that issue. we found these cabinets in the basement and I just brought them out, planned around them and uh, we painted them and used them in our kitchen. One of the things that we needed to do was put in a new door. You could actually see daylight under the old one. Um, so we got that done and then we started putting in our new flooring. Again, we were kind of just trying to get it done um, on our timeline and a lot of the products for countertops were back ordered so we ended up giving the butcher block a try. Um, we will see how it holds up over time but it ended up looking really nice in the space once it was finished. So in the old building the trim is 
uh, very big and kind of uh, holds to the scale of the building. So we ended up using one by sixes to trim out our doors and around the floor. Um, and then just painted that white to kind of go with everything else. But I feel like the scale of the trim is a lot better than if we had gone with something smaller and kind of more traditional. This project ended up taking us a few months to complete, um, longer than we had hoped, but we are really happy with the way it turned out. Um, let us know what you think. And thank you so much for watching. We hope to see you next week.